What's up, up Sky Squad? Squad? Welcome back. So today we have our princess Ellie in the back of the car. She's so good in the car. Oh my gosh. So you guys absolutely love the video where we brought Franklin into Petco and bought him whatever he touched. A lot of people requested that Ellie went into this store. If you guys don't know who Ellie is, she is our new rescue dog. We got her in October. She was actually on the news. She was rescued from an abuse case and she has scars all over her nose i'll play the little news clips that way you get a little bit more information about her dogs neglected and kept in poor conditions now getting the care they need and authorities suspect a few had been used for a dog fighting ring in the bay area home abc action news reporter marisol Burgo shows us where the dogs are now and who's now facing jail time these 23 dogs are getting better at the shelter Animal Control rescued them from this home in Hillsborough County two days ago. You know, certainly it pulls on your heartstrings. I mean, we, you know, most of the guys do this work because they love, an, love animals. But authorities say Jarvis Lynch was not taking care of them. Roger Mills, the director of Animal Control, believes he neglected them. The uh, cages they were in were almost completely enclosed and filth, no water. If they had water, it was full of feces. Mills says the cages were stacked in the backyard of this home. Neighbors had no idea there were that many animals here. And I didn't even know they had dogs down there. Today you can see the cages haven't been moved. Some of those dogs needed medical attention. You could see scars on others. Mills says five of them had been used for dog fighting at another location. That's not what they're made for. They're made for loving and being companions. Lynch is charged with various counts of cruelty to animals and baiting, possessing animals for dog fighting. To make them fight each other and everything, it's appalling. I mean, that, that's just, that's just, I guess they're known in nature. Maricela Burgos, ABC Action News. So yeah, that is Ellie. Ellie also has cancer or like a tumor on her foot and she was basically locked in a backyard for like her whole life. This is only her second time going into Petco. And the first time she went there, she was really good, really, really good. So, so we're really excited to bring her in. And we also have a GoPro and a dog harness. So you guys are gonna get to see her pick things in a little bit of a first person view. Do you have anything to say? I'm ready to go shopping. Are you ready to go shopping, Ellie? Are you ready, girl? What do you Speak think? You. This what is... do you think? You just relaxed and calm. You gonna bring some of them home? Bring the bacon home? Are you get okay, Ellie. You have to. Hey, what are you doing? Uh, you gonna lay down? All right, let's get Ellie strapped up and go into Petco. All right, Ellie, we are in Petco now. Anything you touch, we'll Wait, buy. She's already at it. Wait, she's scared. It's okay. Good girl. Good girl. Good job. Ellie, we can't buy that box. Good job, Ellie. Oh, you want the Ellie friend? All right, she picked out the elephant so far. It's okay. Franklin picked that one out too. We'll get this one. So far, we got these two. Is it? Yep. Another Ellie? Another Ellie. She's a little scared right now. Come where you go. Home snacks, you want that too? That means we have to buy you a Kong. All right, so far, Ellie only has these four things. So far, she has more than Franklin, though. This one? You're touching everything, Mom. Ellie, no, you're touching everything. Jolly balls. These are so expensive. Oh, do you like it? Yeah. Oh my gosh, she's getting everything. Hey, look, Mom, she's already picked out a lot. This is more than Franklin already. Oh my gosh. She's, she's going through the whole aisle and just touching everything. Now it's time to go down the treat aisle. Bones here. 
Oh, she's so scared. You guys, this is only her second time ever in Petco or even like, I think, you know, in public. She's really been, a, her whole life she has been sheltered and it's so sad. Oh, we got another thing. She picked something. You like that? Let's hold it. Okay, we got these. These look yummy. All right, guys, so far, just a little check-in. Uh, always we can say here is Ellie is killing Franklin and wanting things. I mean, look how much she has compared to what Franklin has. Well, you know, she's learning what everything in the store is, so she wants to touch everything. These green bones, do you like this? Alright, that's flaxseed, that's good. You can't show her, that's cheating. Ugh. Cheater, cheater. All right guys, so this is all the stuff Ellie's bought so far. It's a lot of stuff. I don't even wanna know how much this is gonna cost. We're gonna do one more lap around the store. In case she missed something, we'll be able to get that. You know, this is only our second time here, so I want it to be a good time for her. But so far, I think that it is a good time. I mean, check it out. She's got a lot of stuff in here, guys. Yeah, she got a Probably lot already of like $200 worth of stuff already Probably. right here. She also is a little bit scaredy, but that's okay. We have a lot of noise and people and dogs going on. She's not used to this type of environment, so she's doing very well for her circumstances. We have a little marshmallow here. Ellie wants to buy the whole store, including the metal things. All right guys, so we did a lap through the toy section again. She only found one more thing that she wanted, which was this little marshmallow. And now we're going to check all this out and see what our total price is going to be. All right, you guys, so we are out of Petco now, and that cost a whopping $150. Oh my gosh, Ellie, you have expensive taste, but she did so good in the store. She was, she's just an amazing dog. She walks past all the other dogs, as you saw from her, her view. You know, dogs are barking at her, like, and she just literally just stands there and walks away and ignores it. She's such a good dog. She did such a good job and she loves people. And she spent $50 more than Franklin. Jeez, Ellie. All right, we are home. Good job, Ellie. Are you ready to see your toys that you got? Go get your brothers. Go get your brothers. Hey Frankie, hey Bamboo, hey, what do you have? How'd you get that bone, Bumby? All right, who gets what? Ellie, you did a good job. Jolly ball, I think Yee yeah. wants a jolly ball. Yee? You want that? No. Franklin loves jolly balls. Franklin? Woohoo! All right. Next. Who's up next, Mom? Diaper boy, a little treat. Let's have a bit of DP. DP likes bone marrow really roast. Likes treat. Treat. 
Oh my gosh, Willie, you're so right, picky. Right here. We got treat. Sit, sit, sit. Everybody, sit, sit, sit. Good girl. Ah! Why the dogs putting it in their mouth and dropping it? They'll like put it in their mouth and just drop it. It kind of smells like they're good, does it? They're like Fig Newtons. Oh, it does smell like Fig Newtons. What are you doing? What are you doing, you big toy? Which one do you want, ye? You didn't get to go in the pet store because you get overstimulated. It's not his fault, Bum. It's not, it's not Bumby's fault. Wow, which, one, which one do you want, ye? Which toy do you want? There's no, he's over. An overload, toy overload. Which one? You didn't pick one. That oh, one? That one? Alright, take it. Get it. Get it. Pull it. Pull, pull that it. thing. Pull that thing. Franklin loves jolly balls, dude. Look at his tail. He's like a warthog. want more videos like this with my dogs I had so much fun filming this I think Ellie had fun and of course all my dogs had fun playing with all the toys that Ellie picked out I love you guys so much I will see you guys in my next video bye